continue to track the number of COVID cases here in the greater Houston area. C-TRAC, or the Southeast Texas Regional Advisory Council, tracks numbers in these 25 counties highlighted here, and they're reporting COVID hospitalizations for the past two weeks have been the highest extended duration in its history. So what does that mean? KPRC 2's Andy Sirota joins us live from Harris County Public Health now with a closer look. Andy? Chris, our numbers are not falling in line with what the latest COVID trends are showing across our state. Governor Greg Abbott tweeting about those this morning. Local health experts say that many hospitals across the greater Houston area are setting records and are struggling as resources remain scarce. Governor Greg Abbott's claims on social media that the state's COVID trend is improving is true, but needs context. The president of Harris Health System says while the numbers have come down a bit, they're plateauing at an extremely high level, much higher than they were during the winter surge. This is not the time to celebrate or a high five and, uh, and uh, take vacation time. Uh, Things that are still very, very dire. Yesterday, hospitals in the Harris Health System surpassed their highest number of COVID ICU patients since the start of the pandemic and over the last five days experienced their highest number of COVID related deaths ever. We are at a point uh, that we are literally running out of physical space inside the hospital. I mean, you know, you can't throw another 200 nurses at me. There is nothing I can do with them. COVID hospitalizations across the 25 county region have hit record high levels and a record run over 3,000 for 17 consecutive days. There's no good news in our numbers. The CEO of Cetrac says many hospitals remain overwhelmed, pushing them to their breaking point, with some emergency rooms overflowing with patients, showing no signs of relief. I'm not encouraged at all, not, not at all. We have some terrific needs at some of our hospitals and the nursing staff and the physicians and everybody, the housekeeping staff, they, they are exhausted and there's no one to replace them. They say that hospitals in those areas where vaccination rates are low tend to see the greatest number of patients and tend to be more overwhelmed. They say getting vaccinated is the only way to see us through this. Live in the Galleria area tonight, Andy Sirota, KPRC 2 News.